Hi everyone, Lori Marie here, mixed media artist in Vallejo, California. Thank you so much for joining me. I'm playing with some uh, altered cards, uh, some altered trading cards, ATCs. I was invited to do a swap. I don't want any back. <laughs> I have so much going on here right now, but I did play and uh, I used the same theme on every card, which was very fun for me, uh, very meditative. I didn't have to think about each piece. I just kept going over and over and over uh, the same pieces. So it was really fun. The face I used I got from Cindy. And thank you, Cindy. But we don't know who the artist is. So if you recognize this face and you know who the artist is, please let me know. I would appreciate that. Uh, what else do I have to say? Oh, I got a card from Cheryl. Um, most of you know that my dad is staying with me. We're on day 10. And everything is going very well. We're starting to get some kind of a routine, so it's pretty nice. Anyway, I got a lovely card from Cheryl, and it says, There is always hope. And it says, Even the strongest hands can lose their grip. The greatest of minds can become cloudy. And the biggest of hearts can break. So, be kind. Just always be kind. So, I love that. And it's so pertinent to what I'm going through with my dad right now. He's just wonderful. And, uh, and difficult. So we're, ha we're having mostly a good time. So it's pretty good. All right, so uh, I think that's about it. Yep, I'm going to say it is. See you on the table. So I was invited to, to join in, in an ATC swap. And these are the, I use the same theme over and over again because they're going to go all go to different people. Very, very fun. One face, a uh, fun background, some hair that I sewed on, some white dots, face, it's written all over her face. Ha ha ha. So fun. So, playing card, background techniques, underpants etc. Focal point, half circle, and some sewing and dots. Oh, and of course some stabilo.
All right, people are starting to wake up around here. I have some scrap paper here. I'm just going to make some half circles. And I'm going to glue a half circle on each ATC. Now this is a face I've used before. I love it. If you know who the artist is, please let me know. I can give kudos to that artist. And I'm just taking the faces. I've cut her head off. And I'm just going to glue a half on each page. Just like that with Mod Podge. Using the same theme on each card. Since it's for an exchange, everyone's going to have different cards, which will be fun. I'm just going to go through all the cards like that, put a face on them. I'm going to bring my stays on back in and just hit the edges of all the cards. loving these. All right, I'm going to go around the edge of the face and the circle with my Stabilo. I am a spit and smudge girl. And I will do that to all of the cards. So I put Stabilo on all of the cards and now I'm going to take, it, take them to my sewing machine and I'm going to do some zigzag uh, sewing at the top of that head. I think that'll be fun. Alright, look at these yummy ATCs. I sewed some hair on her. That is so fun. So half of her face is on one card, half of her face is on the other card. So I didn't waste any of it. Now, of course, I'm going to bring in my paint pen and just add some dots. Woohoo! And just play with it like that. Then we'll be done with our ATC cards. So grateful for these. Quick and easy. So I want to show you this. So I put the dots any place I want the energy, of course. But then in her eye, I give her the highlight in her eye. It makes a huge difference. Just one little white dot. So here they are. My ATCs, I believe there's 24 or 25 of them. They are all ready to send off to their new homes. So exciting. And your turn. Go create, go play, go have fun.